it is time for wind down Sundays yes what time is it you guys I'm a little bit late not really but right on time um, it is 8 50 850 8 and we're now getting started but y'all we got a juicy topic tonight I got a drink on this the topic for tonight is have you ever ghosted someone or have you ever been ghosted by someone ghosted meaning you've been talking to somebody and then you just got turned off and blocked them stop responding to them whatever the case may be have you ever but I'm gonna do it with a little twist tonight because I'm tired talking by myself so what I will do is call up about two or three of my family members and have this conversation with them actually I'm gonna call a few and whoever answered their phone I'll probably call my daughter also and see what they say so we will be having conversations you guys and hopefully the phone is loud enough for y'all to hear it so let's do this thing y'all anyway y'all don't forget to like comment subscribe if you haven't and please 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 hit that notification bell so that you will be notified every single time your girl drop because I told y'all we consistent with this thing now yes and I already had one glass this is my second glass y'all but I needed it today I needed it my head hurting I went mean, and got my hair braided as you can see something simple because the birthday coming up so I didn't feel like sitting there all that time and then gotta take it back out in a couple of weeks so How was my week? I had a good week this weekend. I'm I actually excited for this upcoming week. But this week, I had work. Not too much happening. But overall, all my patients were okay. So I had a reasonably good week this week. And this upcoming week, I have a surprise for y'all. But... We'll talk about that a little bit more. I might vlog that surprise, but we'll see. And today, I actually was supposed to go to the store because I want to give one of my patients a care package. And um, I was going to go buy the stuff today, but I'll try and see if I could do it tomorrow because I didn't get the chance to do it today. And it was raining all day today. It's cold outside. It's nasty outside. So I figured... I'll do it tomorrow if I get a chance or Tuesday morning but if I don't get the chance to do the whole care package I'll probably do flowers or something but we'll see how they work anyway let's start this I start with myself first have I ever ghosted someone and why yes I ghosted people several times because y'all I get turned off fast I'm a lover when I'm in love I'm in love and I like you I like you and I go above and beyond I'm a sucker for love but I also get turned off real fast and I don't like hurting people feelings so I'll block you from my phone real fast like without even thinking about it trust me I will block you from my phone so, one time, okay, I ghosted someone because, I don't even know if I should tell y'all this because it's going to be like, she's so shallow, but y'all, okay, I ghosted someone because his dingling was too small. I promise you, I did. So, we were talking... A whole month to I don't know we were talking for a while I liked him really liked him we went out to dinner wine and dine I think I told this story before but anyway this was the one that comes to mind because this one always stick up because of the way I left him 
So after the whole wine and dining thing, y'all, we got to the room, the hotel room, whatever. Yeah, we got a hotel because I got kids. I'm not taking the one to my house. So we got a hotel room, whatever. And we in there and the whole foreplay was good. Everything was good, but then he wanted to turn the lights off. And I'm like, why are you turning the lights off? This is the first time you're going with somebody. So I want to see what I see. Y'all, when I saw it, I kid you not, this was it. Mind you, dude was about 6'5", six, 6'4", six, tall, masculine, nice looking, handsome, this. That tongue was off the chain, but this, y'all, I couldn't do it. I, 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 I couldn't even pretend. I'm sorry. So what I did was I said I had to pee, and I went in the bathroom with my phone, and I called my friend, and I told her, call me and say something wrong with the kids. So she called. I said, I got to go. Something's wrong with my kids. It's an emergency, y'all. And I got dressed and I left and I blocked them in and I never saw him again. That was one of the reasons. And another reason I ghosted someone was because his breath was smelling. The first time, you know, you have accidents. So the first time we were stalking, whatever, not nice looking dude. I like tall men because I'm short. I'm 5'2". So you'll always see me with a tall dude. 6'1", six, 6'2". Six, That's just me. So... The first time we talked, we went out to dinner, it was like, oh, hmm, maybe, whatever not. But then the second time, y'all, we went to the movies, and you know somebody sitting right, like, right next to you, right next to you, and keep whispering in your ears, and you gotta be like, huh? And hold your breath. I can't do it, so do that to go blocked his ass also but anyway those were reasons for me to ghost people those are reasons but let's call some people and see I was gonna ask this question on Instagram but y'all be taking so long to respond y'all so I figured I'm gonna do it a little bit different just until Y'all get it together. So since y'all don't want to get it together, then, yeah. So the first person I start with is my sister. She answers the phone. So let's start with her. Hopefully you guys can hear it, y'all. Hey, girl. Hi, she answered the phone, you guys. I thought she wasn't gonna answer the phone because I told her I was gonna call her. Turn the volume down, Michelle. All right, I called you because I'm recording and I'm talking about this topic and I wanna see how you feel about it or have you ever. The topic that we're talking about tonight is have you ever ghosted someone or has someone ever ghosted you? And what reason would you have to ghost it to ghost somebody? Like, um, what's a dead giveaway for you to ghost somebody? Like, I don't want to mess with them no more. I don't want to talk to this person no more. I have, I have not experienced either one of them, though. I have never been ghosted, and no one has ever ghosted. I, I haven't ghosted anyone, so I don't. I don't think I would be suitable to answer that question because it's never it's never happened to me. But what would make you want to go with somebody? I don't know because I've never had to do it. <laughs> so I don't know. I, I, I can't answer that question because I don't know. I honestly don't know. Oh. <laughs> if I say something, I'll be making stuff up. I've never been in that position to go someone or, you know, have been ghosted okay all right so we'll go on to the next since you've never been ghosted or you don't have a clue why you would want to ghost somebody so let's try to find so let's try and see if we find someone else that has ghosted someone before bye girly thank you for answering
All right, y'all. My sister, to be honest with y'all, she's so innocent. She's had like one or two boyfriends because when she's with someone, she's with them for the long haul. So she telling the truth that I could tell y'all. But I'm going to call someone else that this one right here, she probably have. Let's see. If she'll answer her phone, y'all. Hey, girl. So, I'm recording, right? And I'm, I'm asking these questions. And I want to ask you this question to see if this ever happened to you. The topic for tonight is, have you ever been ghosted by someone or have you ever ghosted someone? I have been ghosted by someone. Someone ghosted you? Sure did. Why? Uh, I thought the conversation was good. I thought that was, you know, I, I, I thought it was good, but then a day or two after, when I tried to hit them up or reach out, it was like no communication, not even the profile that I haven't seen before. So I'm thinking to myself, what did I say? Mm. Or what happened? Dang. Or maybe this person was never real or or something like that. But I don't know why. I felt so bad. But then later on, I was like, maybe it's a fake profile. Somebody just created something. They was talking to me, chop it up. Because something, somebody that I never met before. And then I just didn't see the whole profile, nothing. Everything was just deleted, gone. Oh, man. Why? Yeah. But yeah, it happened. That's crazy, but have you ever ghosted someone before? Now, I've been turned off by someone, but not ghosted like you will be texting me, hitting me up, and I won't reply. Not like that, no. Oh, okay, okay. So, like you're the more sure. polite person, like, you'll just, like, break it off slowly. Stop talking slowly, to them slowly. Right. Yeah, because I'm worried about people and their feelings and stuff like that. So, yeah, it will be a slow process, but surely. But it, it would never be like, I'm not answering my phone, I'm blocking you. Uh, I would never talk to you again, no. I won't do that. Okay, I've done that before several times. Like, wow. I just block you. Like, I don't even want to be bothered. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> yeah. There is a cold world out here, bro. Wow. It is. Like, I'll just block you. I just don't want to be bothered no more. Like, mm hmm. Yep. So, if you're not seeing my profile no more, I've blocked you. Is that because you were disrespected? That you wasn't. You didn't think that the person that ended up to be the person that you thought they were? Why yeah, and it was just disappointed. Like, the, the one I blocked because. His hygiene wasn't up to par. His breath was smelly. <laughs> like, I gave him one chance. So, like I was telling my um, followers, like, my subscribers, like, the first time we went to dinner, it was like, but he was sitting across from me. So, you smelt it when you was talking. But I was like, you know, sometimes people mess up, whatever not. He probably forgot to brush his teeth. I don't know. So, I'm going to give you a ch second chance. But then, the second time, we went to the movies. And you know, homeboy sitting like right next to you. Right here. Trying to whisper in your face and your ear. And I keep turning my face like, dude, mm -mm, you got halitosis or something. So we left the movies. And then dude tried to kiss me when he dropped me off. I was like, uh-uh, uh, -uh, uh, -uh. Can't do that. You're doing too much, homeboy. Not with what, that kind of breath. That one, the one, but you just, he just needed some I ain't trying to find that out. No, man. Mm-mm. <laughs> he was on block, like, blocked. Mm-mm. Wow. I'm not trying to find out. Sorry. Just, 
blessing right there. Mm -mm. I'm going to find another blessing. There is a whole lot more blessings going around. Not that one. No, ma'am. Mm -mm. Anyway, y'all. Thank you, girly, for answering. Let me see if I catch anyone else on this phone. Because I just called Michelle and she's never been ghosted. Or has never ghosted anyone. So, um... Yeah, that He blocked you. If you're not seeing that account no more, he blocked you. <laughs> I don't know what you was telling homeboy. Homeboy said, mm -mm. I think I was just trying to be honest. You know, with them three kids. You told him off the back you had three kids. Homeboy said, I can't do that. No, it's like I said, it's a two, three day of communication. And stuff like that. Mm. Yeah, I wasn't in a good enough space. Anyway, all right. I'm about to call one of my crazy daughters and see what they think. Bye. Thank you. Hello. Hey girl, you still on the line? Of course. Oh, anyway, I was just calling you for two minutes of your time. I am recording and I'm calling you guys asking you this question. My topic for tonight is, have you ever been ghosted by anyone or have you ever ghosted anyone before? And why? I've never been ghosted, but I did ghost somebody. <laughs> Why did you ghost them? They first thing. I wasn't going to Oh my gosh, I just said that. That's why I ghosted someone also. Because of the first thing you in there for Oh my gosh. I just I was just saying this like I gave homeboy. We went to dinner and that's all I smelled, but I was like, you know, sometimes People forget to brush their teeth. So I was like, maybe he was in a rush. Let me give him a second chance. So now we went to the movies on a second date. And a homeboy sitting right next to you in your face trying to talk. I was like, mm-mm. And then when he dropped me off trying to kiss, I was like, uh-uh. What's wrong with you, honey? Block and delete. I made it all the way to the, the parking lot and turned back around. <laughs> you didn't make it to Left dinner? Left eye. <laughs> I, I, called, I called it through. I was like, do you really want to sit there? And, and even the food is not going to taste right. Oh my gosh. Just don't, don't even do it. Don't even do it. So did you block him or you just stopped answering your phone? No, I moved out of the country altogether. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> oh wow <laughs> like I moved out but physically I was there but telephone <laughs> <laughs> like dude I'm not even in your country no more I'm in a totally different nope. country nope I don't move I know that's right the heck but yeah Anyway, girly, thank you for answering. On to the next. Welcome. You welcome. Yeah. <laughs> All right, y'all. Y'all see, I'm not the only one that had these problems. People had them also. Now, let me call. Now, these were the older folks that I called. People in their mid-30s, closer. My sister in her 40s. That one has never been ghosted. Now I'm going to call one of my daughters. Let's try that. This one right here. Let me see which one is going to answer the phone. Because my kid's crazy, you guys. Hello. Hey, little girl. Hey. What you doing? I'm not hungry. You're always hungry. So, 
I got you on camera. I'm recording. Well, your voice is on camera. I'm recording. I have a question for you. So I've heard it from the older crowd. Now I'm calling my child. Well, I tried calling Tifa before. Now I'm calling you. And the question for today is, let me hear it from the younger folks. Have you ever been ghosted by someone or have you ever ghosted someone? And why? <laughs> um, I don't get ghosted. I do the ghosting. <laughs> okay, Miss Ghosting. Why have you been ghosting people? I get tired of people fast. You're thinking on my nerves. <laughs> they get... So you get tired of people because you don't want to talk. That's why you ghost them? Yeah. Okay, but on a serious note, what's the most serious reason that you've ghosted someone? Um, I don't know. I don't think I really had a serious reason. Sometimes when I give people my number and they just text me too much, I be tired of talking, so I just don't text them back. I probably block their number too. Mm, okay, I see. Okay, honey boo boo sugar. Thank you for answering the phone. We'll move on to the next and see if they got a serious reason why they ghosted someone. I'll talk to you in a little bit. Bye. Okay, and I text you. I did see that, and I'll text you back when I'm done recording. Goodbye. Okay. Okay, y'all, this is the last one that we're calling, and we're going to close off with her if she answers the call. If she don't answer the call, then we're going to have to call someone else to make them our last person and go from there. This one is not answering the call, so I want someone that's actually gonna give me a conversation you guys but y'all it's interesting what I actually wanted to do was put the question out on um, Instagram like I normally do and get the answers but I was caught up being busy and I forgot about it to be honest and then I was like I don't want to put it late minute because normally if I want to do a Q&A or I'll ask a question I'll do it like a day or two before because y'all be taking the 23rd hour to ask me a question so that's why I didn't really you know put it on there so I figured I'll do it a little bit different and call them and ask them but um I've talked to friends and stuff and they've had different reasons why they've been ghosting people but um I wanted I just wanted to hear it from my family hey girl oh can you turn that TV down a little bit hey Rhonda can you turn the TV down a little bit can you hear me yeah what's up can you turn the TV down a little bit? I turn it on. Um, I'm going to. What's up? Okay. I got a question for you. And my question is, since you my turn up cousin, have you ever been ghosted by someone or has someone ever ghosted you and why? <laughs> I don't know why, but yeah. You've been ghosted before. Mm. What did they do? Did they block you? Um, yeah. You are okay, who playing that music? I'm gonna get copyrighted for that music. Yeah, I'll go. Oh. Oh, oh okay. Yeah, alright. I'm gonna have to cut my conversation short to drama get copyrighted. I'm recording it, that's why. And I'm gonna get copyrighted for the music. Oh. Yeah. Alrighty. We're gonna chat next time. Alright, babe. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I couldn't continue with her because they have music playing in the background and 
You girl is not trying to get copyrighted, so I had to cut her. But this one was the one to give us the stories, but I couldn't really get into it because of the music and my attention span. So I'm going to try and call someone else that could actually give me a nice story. I don't know who to call. I was trying to get some more of my cousins, some more of my friends to jump on the call with me, but... It wasn't working out. I guess it's too late Sunday or they're busy or they doing like I'm doing cleaning my house. Well, like I was doing earlier cleaning my house and stuff, but I can get more of them on the phone and the video also was going to be way too long. So I decided to cut it short, but I still got a few of them. I still got a good few of them and hopefully the video turns out really nice anyway y'all like comment hit that notification bell so that you will be notified every single time your girl drops and y'all have a wonderful night you guys and until next sunday same time same place on wind down sundays